Alright guys, we're back with another episode of Greedfall. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you've been liking the series so far. Thank you so much for the likes and the support. Make sure that you do subscribe to my channel if you don't want to miss any future videos. And let's get to it, guys. Um, I guess I'll go see Constantine real quick. Governor's Palace. She's still cleaning that floor, y'all. You guys look like you're acting a play out or something. Cousin! You have returned to me. Your absence was sorely felt. You don't appear to be in top form. Are house intrigues keeping you from finding proper sleep? No. Nothing to bring me nightmares as of yet. I'm blaming it on the change of diet. Now, tell me what adventures you've been up to. If you only knew how bored I grow behind these walls. We were not able, alas, to stop the clash between the forces of the Alliance and Siora's clan. We arrived at the village and battlefield too late. The Queen fell. I'm extremely sorry for your loss princess thank you my sister survived fortunately and we are recovering from this tragedy together but our clan was extremely weakened by this battle and by recent events we shall keep a close eye on the bridge alliance and their undertakings rest assured you should know that the battle took place in the middle of ancient ruins the ruins were quite strange we discovered a fresco that I am certain was crafted by continental hands. Really? And how ancient are these ruins? Could they date back to the first landings of the Bridge Alliance? They date much farther back than their arrival would explain. My mother and my grandmother have always known them. Siora told me of a legend that spoke of them. About a people from the sea that were vanquished there. Do you think it was the Norths? It is not our custom to found a landlocked settlement. We have our islands, and it is enough for us. If they are ancient, perhaps your people once practiced older customs. This story is troubling, but it reminds me of something that I once read in the reports of Lady Morange. You should go and find her. Perhaps she could tell us more about them. Very well. Anything else? I'm going to leave now. Nope. Goodbye, Constantine. Look out for yourself. Always do. Desarde, I have a favor to ask. Very well, I'm listening. Do you remember the story of Jonah? Of course. Well, I'm like him. A donation to the sea. My family also gave me to the Nords. I don't know anything about my real family, except that they are probably affluent and from the congregation. When I was born, the Norts and the Merchant Princes had a complex relationship. I must have been used to settle a debt or forge a truce, but that doesn't matter. The mystery of my origins has now become an obsession. I need to know where I come from. If I were patient enough, I'd wait to become a fleet commander, and then I would be told. But since being laid off... Such a promotion seems somewhat improbable. And you want me to help you find this information? You understand correctly. The records of all seamen stationed on the island are in their respective ports. Seamen. Mine must be in the harbor <laughs> office in New Serene, and it must contain my family name. But if I go there, I'd be spotted right away. Could you go there and bring the file to me? For sure. Another time, maybe. Alas, I'm too busy at the moment. I understand. Come back when you have more. Did you want anything else? I must leave you.
Rain Blood. Tell me, do you remember that young recruit I, I spoke to you What's about? I would still like to present. Him. So then. But of course. Let's. Raina must be with the other recruits in the barracks. I had thought you were lone wolf with only our good friend in your pack. But I was mistaken. I am full of surprises, pretty she wolf. Good day, soldiers. Your Excellency. Captain. Soldiers, may we be of service. Rank and assignment, soldiers. Recruit, first class, Blue Silver Regiment, 8th Company, Your Excellency. The Blue Silver Regiment is made up of men attributed to serve the Congregation of Merchants. I'm one of them, and the 8th Company was sent to Tier for D, with two other companies. Anything else, Excellency? What is your charge? Maintain order in the city, Excellency. Anything else, Excellency? Excellency. I'm looking for the soldier, Rayner. Is he in the barracks? I never heard that name before, Captain. Never heard the name, Captain. That's strange. I'm certain he was sent here. Maybe he's been moved since then. When was the last time you'd heard news of him? In Serene. Just before our departure. But that's been a couple of months. If I may, Captain, sh should I have a word with the Quartermaster? That's right, Captain. He has a register with the affectations of every recruit in the Blue Silver Regiment. Anything else, Excellency? No. Nope. That will be all. At ease, soldiers. At ease. Hello, Your Excellency. What can I do for you? I've been looking for one of my recruits. Goes by the name of Rayner. I would like for His Excellency to meet him. Rayner? I'm sorry, Kurt. I thought you'd been informed. Informed about what? He is dead. He was found, drowned in the port harbor day before yesterday. I was told he had too much to drink and fell in. I'm extremely sorry, Kurt. The young men drink more than they can handle when they're on leave. That's bollocks. That lad isn't the sort to sully himself with drink. I don't believe it. People change. When they're far from home, the lads have little else to do. I still don't believe it. Listen, you might as well go and ask the doctor down in the morgue. I might have misunderstood what was reported to me. Those doctors use such long words for simple things. Excellent idea. At least you'll see it for yourself. You're right. Let's go. Is there anything else? N no, thank you. No, y'all are very sketch, this coin guard. Well now, a visit. Can I help you with something? We are here concerning the matter of Recruit Rayner. Are you family or friends? You could say that. I'm the one who recruited the lad. I see. Well, what I can do is tell you what I can. When was the body brought to you? Day before yesterday, in the early morning. Can you tell me anything about the circumstances? All I know is what I was told by the fellows who brought the body to me. They said they'd spent the evening together at the tavern, that they'd had a great deal to drink. A horrid habit the soldiers all seemed to share. Rayner was not a drinker. Maybe not. All the same, he was drinking that night. He stepped outside for a moment and never came back in. His companions found him drowned in the bay early morn. And they brought him to me. 
How then did he die, in your opinion? He drowned. I'm sorry. It's regrettable. He was quite a young man. Yeah, and his death makes no sense. He didn't drink, and he knew how to swim. All the same, that's what happened. I greatly regret it. He sounds like he's hiding something. Might we take a look at the body? Um, no, I wouldn't recommend that. To see your friend in such a state. I'm a soldier, Doc. I've seen a number of men in pieces. Let me see the young lad. I... I regret, Captain, I cannot allow that. I have, as of yet, to present myself. I'm Lady de Sade, Legate of the Congregation of Merchants on Tirfredi. And as the title infers, I have the power to inspect this barracks and all that it contains. Therefore, I must insist. I see. A thousand pardons, Excellency. I should have recognized you and shown more respect. It's the body in the middle. Examine him if you must. But please be so kind as to not leave a mess after you. This one is just a boy. His face is still locked in an expression of pain. Kurt, is this your recruit? Yes, that's my reign. Poor kid. I should have left him with his family where he was. We'll need to examine the body to learn more. Is that all right? This is not the first young man I've seen with the lights gone from his eyes. Go on. I'm no doctor, but this boy doesn't seem to have drowned at all. It looks like he's been beaten. It's suspicious. The boy I knew would never have drunk himself senseless to the point he'd fall into the bay, I'm telling you. I believe you, Kurt. But if we want to prove it, we'll need to find more evidence. Well, that's what that body was from earlier that we saw. Excuse me, Doctor, but you owe us a few explanations. This boy did not die by drowning. It is absolutely the cause of death, I assure you. The science of death is a complex art, and you are certainly not a doctor. That is true, but you are. Do you recognize your own notes? Your writing is hard to read, but the word drowning never appears. Idiot! I should have burned those notes. I am truly sorry. I, I swear I have never, ever falsified a report before. But I was given no choice in the matter. How's that? What are you talking about? <laughs> Two men, uh, uh, lieutenants, I believe, brought a body to me telling me the boy had drowned in an accident. I saw immediately this was a lie, but I did not push the matter. I began my examination, planning to submit my report to the quartermaster as per usual. But the men returned. I was told to forget what I'd discovered and say that he had indeed drowned, or else. Who were they? I have no idea. I had never seen them before at the barracks. I, I guess their rank by their uniforms. What colors were they sporting? None. They must have removed the emblems of their regiment. Listen, it's obvious that this boy was beaten repetitively, and that was the cause of death. I have no intention of suffering the same fate. Have no fear, Doctor. We will make no mention of your name. Andevors Tire. That means, may the Earth welcome him. I am sorry for you, Kurt. Thank you, Siora. Hello, Your Excellency. What can I do for you? We have a situation, Manfred. Rainer didn't drown. The doctor falsified his report. 
He was threatened and feared for his own life. You have to be pulling me leg. Who bullied the crow face? Lieutenants that he didn't recognize, alas. And who wore no regiment emblems. Which regiment was Rainer assigned to? I would like to have a word with his commanding officer. Let me have a look at the register. My memory isn't what it once was. Stab my heart with a rusty blade. His name's been crossed out. Oh, if I catch the bastard that did that. What mess was the boy into, Manfred? What could this be about? Your lad was in the 6th or maybe the 11th before being reassigned to who knows where. Just like that? You out of everyone have to know where the recruits are assigned. Not of late. This isn't the first lad who's been reassigned all of a sudden at the drop of a hat. Each time I start complaining about it, I'm told they've changed regiments. And it's not my concern. Something truly bizarre is going on here. I don't like this at all. Let's try and discover which company he was stationed at before this mysterious reassignment. Is there anything else? Nope. No, thank you. I need to get to the bottom of this mystery, Greenblood. I don't like being taken for a fool. Even if the lieutenants weren't stationed at these barracks, someone here must know where Rayner was assigned. We should also go and check the tavern. Men on leave will perhaps have looser lips than those within the walls. All right, so there is definitely some fishy-ish going on here. <laughs> Investigate the tavern. Okay. Well, let's go, I guess, outside and go around and do that. Fishy, fishy, fishy. Are we gonna find it here? Excellency! I saw you in the palace, if I'm not mistaken. Your Excellency has a good eye and memory. I am one of the officers, in charge of the protection of your cousin's counselors. How can I help you? We are investigating the death of a young recruit. A certain Rainer. I've never heard the name before. He's not one of my men. I know. But you might at least have heard someone mention him in passing. Did he die at the palace? No. We have no idea where it happened, only where the body was found. So? Yeah, I'm, I'm sorry. That doesn't ring any bells. None at all. How is this kid just like, nobody knows who he is? I recruited the lad myself, Lieutenant. And just a while ago, I saw his body broken and bruised in the morgue. Mm. Someone has been trying to cover this up. To lead us down false trails at every turn. But Rayner deserves justice. Yes, he does. I know you have to understand that. I hear you. The murder of one of our own should not go unpunished. But alas, I don't know how I can help you. This is the first I've heard about it. Try this fellow. Good day, Lieutenant. Milady, you're one of the governor's confidants, see you not? Indeed. De Sarde, the governor's legate. My sincere pardon, Excellency. I didn't want to show any disrespect. Captain? Lieutenant, how can I help you? We seek information concerning a young recruit, a certain Rainer. Rainer? Sorry, name isn't familiar to me. He must be with another company. Are you sure about that? This is an speak. important matter. I'm certain, Captain. Was he family to you? I recruited him. You know what that's like. The boy was killed and then tossed in the bay. I want the head of whoever's responsible. I did hear talk of a young lad found in the port waters. That's my sector. But I was told that it was an accident, and I had no reason to doubt it. Are you sure the lad was murdered? Absolutely certain. Beaten to death, to be precise. Mm. That's Savage. horrible. But I don't know anything about it. Too bad. Thank you all the same. Goodbye, Lieutenant. 
All right. Let's try this man. Good day, soldier. Uh, good day. Good day, my lady. Desarde, legate of Desarde. the congregation on Tier 3D. Captain Kurt. Oh, I. Excuse me, Excellency. I. I didn't know. Captain, I. I truly am sorry. At your service, my lady. Excellency. Excellency. You don't quite look like you've got the hang of all this. How long have you been in? I. Is it that obvious? It's quite normal for a new recruit. I joined up four months ago, but at the beginning we were on board ship, you see. I don't know if that really counts. I started exercises when we got to New Serene, but I'm making progress, they say. And do you like it here? I sure do. That's why I joined the Guard. To come here, to leave the continent. Know what I mean? I do. Anything else? Mm. Since you know who we are, present yourself, soldier. Ah, yes, my lady. Recruit 2nd Class Alric, Blue Silver Regiment, 11th Company, at your service. Anything else? Here. You seem tired and a little on edge. A drink would do you some good. It's just that I don't know if I'm allowed. You're on leave, or you wouldn't be at the tavern. Then why not? Yes, but this is His Excellency's own bottle. I don't know if I can. Drink, Drink I tell you. <laughs> now then, why don't you tell us what you know about Rainer? Is she dragging well, him? I didn't. I didn't serve with him. Well, not really. We just crossed paths. He was leaving the 11th when I joined. Everyone said he was good, strong, and uh, followed orders. And then, poof, Lieutenant got this order, and he wasn't happy. And I mean really quite unhappy. And then Rayner, he was gone. We never saw him again. We asked where he'd been sent, but the Lieutenant didn't want to tell us. Said that it was none of our business. But you, he won't be able to say no to you. You should go and offer him a drink, too. Where can we find your lieutenant? At the barracks. Thank you. And watch yourself when leaving. Wouldn't want you to fall into the bay. That will be all, soldier. Thank you. Uh, thank you, Your Excellency. Snooch. Alright, where do we go for this? So, I just was curious, where are all my followers from? I know that I don't have a ton yet, but it's definitely grown. Um, when I started this channel with this first series, obviously I had no followers, and I am already up to about 15 in just about two days, which I am blown away at. I know it takes a little while, and to me that seems kind of fast. So. Um, and my views are already up to like 60 or 70 a video. So thank you guys so much for all that. I really, 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 really appreciate it. Um, that keeps me motivated and makes me want to keep going and doing more, especially more series. Because I know it's like one series is cool, but, you know, different games definitely will be more interesting for you guys and for me too. So, so I'm excited. So thank you guys so much. So I was just curious where are my followers um, that I have are from so far so leave it in the comment section below where are you guys located I am in Arizona I don't know if any of my followers are from Arizona but I am an Arizona native and I am in Arizona still to this day <laughs> hello your excellency what can I do for you no well, why didn't you tell me to talk to him then I wonder if he's in the love shack, guys. <laughs> Sometimes you might hear um, a voice in the background. Um, me and my mom hang out a lot, so sometimes she will watch me play games. Uh, so if you hear a random voice here and there, that is my mom. She's not here right now, but um, she was here the other day when I was recording the part and I said about the love shack and she's like what is a love shack and how is anybody going to even know what that is I'm like 
people know what a love shack is? Come on now. But just in case you don't know, um, basically it's like where inappropriate things <laughs> go on. I guess what I would consider is like swinger sesh, which is what it seemed like was happening there. So I don't know if that's really what was happening, but it was funny. So we're going to go with it. Where the hell are these people? Okay, I think I'm getting somewhere finally. Jesus. Jesus. Oh, yeah, here he is. Hello, officer. Excellency, can I do something for you? Could you tell me which company you serve? The 11th, Excellency. Trip him up. Anything else? What's your assignment? The 11th is assigned to road and outpost security for the congregation on the island. As for me, I'm responsible for the training of recruits and the patrol duty roster. Anything else? Rainier. We are concerned about the death of a young recruit named Rainer. Let's be perfectly straight. We know that Rainer belonged to your company. And as the acting lieutenant well, instructor, serious, you certainly right had him under your command. So just stop with the lies. We've lost enough time here. You know what they say. Guard business is well guarded. And concerns only the guard. Now unless you've lost your eyesight, you've a captain in front of you. I... I know. But this story Kurt's is dangerous, Captain. Kurt's not having captain. any of this bullshit. If you have so much as an ounce of respect for the boy, speak to us. Don't you believe he deserves justice? Yes. Of course. But you have no idea what's been going on here. If word got round that I've been talking, come back after sundown. When there's fewer folk. Very well. We'll be back. <sighs> Anything else? He <laughs> just breathed. <laughs> Thank you, Lieutenant. I'm gonna be back. Farewell. That man was shaking and looking over his shoulder, as if he thought a predator had caught his scent. Whatever could terrify your warriors to jitter so. I don't know yet, but I will find out, Siora. I feel like those two would be cute together. Y'all should, y'all should get together. Come on, we got shit to do, guys. Just too cute. I also mentioned on one of my uh, videos, I think it was in the second one about my cat, so if you ever hear meowing in the background or scratching or any of that, it is my cat. <laughs> I try to edit stuff like that out, but it's life, guys, right? I mean, we all have pets and family and, and whatnot, so let's be realistic here. <laughs> Sometimes it's fun when my mom watches me play. I like when people watch me play or they keep me company. I think it's more fun like that. So, um, I have been getting a couple um, requests for me to do. Let me see. Hold on one sec. Wait until nightfall. Okay. So, I guess I just have to wait. I don't even know what time it is right now. There was a clock on it last time or a timer. It's probably getting to be nighttime though so we'll just walk I'll I'll head towards my uh, my crib and we can chat for a second um it's definitely more fun I feel like when you have people watching you keeping you company oh I was saying about the that's what I was talking about about the uh, webcam so I've had a couple of my friends and a couple of subscribers say that I should actually stream um, while I'm playing and I just didn't do that yet because this is my first series and I just wanted to see if anything even came of it if anybody even watched it or I had two views you know so I just wanted to see so if that is something that you guys want me to do if you want me to webcam I probably won't do it every single video um, but I wouldn't mind occasionally doing or if there are certain videos that you want me to actually webcam and stream um, or Twitch or anything like that like I can definitely do that 
I think that might be fun to do with some scary games if I play some scary games. I don't know if you guys want to me to Twitch or, or a webcam for this whole long series, but um, I can definitely do that if you guys would like that. I got a couple requests for that, so I don't mind doing it if you guys want me to do it. Let me know what you think in the comments about that as well. Good day, Lady Morange. Do you remember me? Of course, Lady de Sardé, isn't it? I hope that you and your cousin have grown to like it here. But I have little reason to believe you have paid me a visit to exchange civilities. Can I be of service? What do you know about the ruins found to the northwest of here? <laughs> the site that the natives call Didakidnadagase. That is not how we pronounce it, but yes, we are speaking of the same place. <laughs> your language is difficult to master, but I find it fascinating. Uh, to answer your question, I had countless questions about the place when our explorers and scouts first brought back sketches. Intrigued, I went there. I noted the architecture and their decorations. It is certain that they bear a striking resemblance with continental constructions, but they are more ancient. Too old to have been recently built by the Bridge Alliance settlers when they first set foot on the island. I even questioned the natives, but they only spoke of a people of the sea. My first thoughts went to the Norts, but they're not known for building large towns, less so cities. There are other ruins on a cliff to the east of here. Perhaps they hide the key to this mystery. I hoped to organize an expedition, but the region is dangerous and hard of access. We explored mines at the bottom of the cliff, but we were not able to find an access to the plateau. If the mystery of these ruins intrigues you as much as me, it is in that direction that you should begin to look for answers. Can I help you with any other matter? I feel like I may have asked what her this before. What can you tell me about New Serene? It's a new city whose construction began not long ago. When I arrived five years ago, there was just a port, a fence, and some huts here. The businesses, the barracks of the guard, the palace, and all of the houses sort of sprung up from the ground. To see how impressive it is today, even if it is still far from its majestic mother, is incredible. Of course, with such expanse, all kinds of bandits, drunkards, and other lowlife have arrived. But I'm very proud of it, in spite of everything. I hope that your cousin continues this work. He will. What do you know about this island? Much less than I would like. The land is still wild and extremely rich. Its soils are full of minerals, some of which are unknown to us. With regard to the flora and fauna, you've probably seen how different the creatures and plants mm -hmm. are here. The Beast. islanders protect their land fiercely, and we cannot begrudge them that. When you see what we have done with our own, well, such a source of richness attracts greed. Yep. True story. You seem interested in the islanders. As a matter of fact, I find their culture fascinating, but I can't say I know much about them. They are quite secretive and protect their cult and traditions from the curiosity of strangers. I know that their sages, they call them Donegada, are the guardians of their rituals as well as of the island. They have very strong links with nature and the creatures that inhabit it. They're also good healers. I could talk about them for hours, but you will learn more from the islanders themselves. She's standing right here, Siora. What can you tell me about the relations we have with other nations? We play a difficult role, caught between these two enemy nations who are nonetheless our allies. The smallest action could tip the balance and draw us into their conflict. If I may offer some advice, be very careful. We do not want a war to break out here. Yeah, def, def not. We don't want war. My lady, I have to go. Goodbye. Goodbye. All right. 
Let me go to the crib and then we'll head back to the tavern. Back to the crib. Boom, boom. I think it said nighttime, so we're gonna just do nighttime. Yeah, nightfall. Okay. Hi, Vasco. Ain't seen you in a hot minute. I'm gonna transition to the tavern, guys. If you guys. Ooh. If you guys are playing this, I definitely recommend using your headphones because there's a lot of surround noises that go on. I'm playing with my headset, um, with my mic on my headset, but I definitely recommend playing this with headphones on because you can hear all the surround noise. Like I just heard babies crying. I don't know if you can hear that on the TV. I felt like when I had it on just the TV, I couldn't hear all that. It definitely puts you more into the game. You feel like you're right there, so. I would definitely play with your headset on. Sometimes I hear noises and I have to take my headset off because I have to figure out if that's in my house <laughs> or it's in the game. Like there was like a thumping and I thought for sure somebody was thumping something outside, but it was definitely on the game, so. Okay, we gotta go, it's not him, we gotta go back outside. There's still a ton of people here, what are you talking about? Come back when nobody's here. Okay, they're just not in here, I guess. We are quite alone now. You may speak to us. Reyna was indeed a member of my company, and an excellent recruit. But you already know that. Continue. One morning, I got a note telling me he'd been transferred from my company. He'd received a new assignment. I was so furious that I did my own little investigation to see where he'd been sent. It wasn't easy. No one wanted to give me answers. No one seemed to know anything. But one thing's for certain. Rayner wasn't the only man to have... disappeared. I learned that a good many recruits all the cream of the crop had been reassigned. And finally, I learned about the existence of a phantom regiment. What sort of nonsense are you talking about? A sort of secret elite company that were following a special training program. Where can we find them? I've no idea. I had to put my investigation to rest. Things were getting dangerous. I began to sense I was being watched. This regiment protects its secrets at all costs with few scruples. If you want to know more, the training officer of the Sixths might know something. It's been said that he took part in one of their missions alongside them. Are you certain you've nothing more to tell me about this infamous secret regiment? I've told you everything I know, at the risk of ending up like Rayner, Excellency. Go and see the officer of the Sixths if you want to learn more. And leave me alone now. Thank you, Lieutenant. Farewell. Farewell. Upstairs. Okay, so I think I'm gonna get us up there real quick. And then I'm gonna end the video. Because uh, we have been walking around for a little while. So I will end the video right after we get up here. And when we come back, we will finish up this mission. And do Vasco's actually as well while we're here. Over here. Over here. I was also thinking about making an Instagram page and stuff. If you guys would like to be more social with me, I would be happy to do that. 
Okay, we're here. So I'm going to go ahead and end the video here. Thank you guys so much for all the love and support. And we missed a box over there too. Hmm. Uh, th sorry. Thank you guys so much for all the love and support. I appreciate it. And I am enjoying doing this series with you so much. I will be back with the next video very soon. Stay tuned. Thanks, guys. See you next time.